Good morning everyone. Welcome to Motivational Monday, the last one before Christmas. Can you believe that Christmas is almost here? This is just crazy. Anyway, I'm hoping to maybe do another vlog for you for Vlogmas before Christmas is here. Um, but really my most interesting day is going to be Christmas Eve and I'm not sure about getting that edited and up. But even so, if you're a person that just tunes in for Monday Motivation, then I want to spend this moment to wish you a very, very happy Christmas and I hope that Santa Claus is good to you. But above all, I hope that you have a lovely time with your family and your friends. And if you're someone that's missing someone, I've said this already, then my heart goes out to you too because it is a time when we remember those loved ones that we we get to miss now at this time of year. But, you know, hold your me memories, treasure and close to your heart, all that stuff. So, <clears throat> how am I going to motivate you today? Well, it's Christmas and it's generally a time when our mind is filled with everything else, like not really anything to do with where we're going, what our dreams are, and then in a week's time, sorry, <clears throat> I really woke up really allergic to something today. It must have been the Pizza Hut gluten-free session yesterday. Oh, sorry about the light. Hang on, we'll turn the corner in a second. Um, so, yeah, and in a week's time, it's crazy that everybody goes, oh, okay, now I want to think about my future. Well, okay, you've got to be doing things in the kitchen, maybe, looking at my stats of people that watch this, and a lot of you are ladies, um, and a lot of men cook in the kitchen as well, don't they? I always get some help from the men at Christmas time. Very lucky to be surrounded by such nice gentlemen. Um, and why not, while you're doing the sprouts or something, listen to a podcast that's going to motivate you. Something that you think, next year I'd like to do that. You know, try and find even a little snippet of time or, or start to think about this time next week, I'm going to be making my plans for next year. Because I have definitely got a drive inside me at the moment and I know exactly what I want to be doing and where I want to be going. The bit I haven't worked out yet is where the time is going to come from to do that. Um, but a lot of you know I'm really keen on blogging. I found an excellent community of people. I'm going to commit to do a couple of courses as well for that. I'm really sorry I could keep looking away here. Um, and I just feel really, really focused and driven at the moment. So I kind of want that to rub off on you guys a little bit because sometimes it takes ages to figure it out. I mean, I've been doing a lot of study for a lot of years. Oh my goodness. Um, so I've just seen something um, so yeah so I've been doing a lot of study for a lot of years trying to kind of get my direction going um, as to like sorry I've really lost my train of thought now but I don't like to cut these clips I like them to be like really raw and how do you like my pink today matches the lipstick um, so I feel quite not passionate, I was already passionate, but I feel now like I maybe have some answers of like where I'm going to go. Let me do that while this sun's going to blast us in the face. Whoa, look at that. It could be Sharmal Shake right now. Um, God bless Sharmal Shake. So, yeah, it's uh, hang on a minute. Oh my goodness. One take, true real me going around the corner, blazing sunshine. Um, so, oh, 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 I think I should end this really. This is a bit of a poor video. But sometimes there's all these messages that go out that say, it doesn't matter, just get your message out there. And what my message basically is, is that if you look hard enough, and sometimes it does take a bit of work, I'm not saying just think about it and there it is. It does take some work and some action, but you can find people. I mean, I've been really motivated by people who are doing what I want to be doing, and they're doing it highly, highly successfully. So I thought, well, why can't I do it highly successfully? If they are, I've just got to learn how they're doing it, implement those strategies into place and I'm going to do it as well. So whether your motivation is you want to lose weight next year, you want to get healthier, and they're generally all quite similar ones. Sometimes it might just be, I don't want to go to bed at midnight, I want to go to bed at by 11 o'clock and that will make such a difference to your dark circles under your eyes, to which I'm testament right now, um, be going to bed too late. So whatever your thing is, just start to plant the seed now before next week you start to say, right now, what am I going to do to make that happen? Um, what is Monday next week? Is it going to be, I don't know, what is it to say, 21st? Oh, it'll be the 28th. So yeah, I will do you a video next Monday. And then we'll probably talk about New Year's resolutions and why they can be really rubbish sometimes, why you perhaps shouldn't do them. But then also make it a bit of a time to say, right, sw swipe the clay sleeve, follow it swipe the clay I can't say it you say it wipe the slate clean that's it and uh, and start afresh and a lot of people say oh well why don't you do these things at all these 
times of the year. It doesn't matter. If, if it resonates with you, just do it. Anyway, I've rambled five minutes. I'm going to work. I hope you have a wonderful Monday and a super, super duper Christmas. Do come back and check in. And I didn't make my 500 subscribers for Christmas. Well, I've got a birthday next week, actually. But it's a bit of a tall order. I've got 444 of you and I love each and every one of you and I'm so grateful for you watching. So thank you. Um, it's really weird sometimes to think like who is actually watching because you know you know a lot of people that are always watching because they always comment and stuff which is lovely so yeah whatever whatever anyway so i will look forward to seeing you next week have a lovely oh gosh sunny day it's eight degrees right now in in kent and i will see you next week thanks for watching please give my video a thumbs up share subscribe do all them things for me and i'll see you soon take care bye for now